All right, here's today's money saving tip. Savings accounts can be kind of weird. Two of the ones that I see a lot of questions about in terms of what's the difference. A high yield savings account versus a CD or a certificate of deposit. Not a CD as in like tower records. Do not put your money in tower records. Both high yield savings accounts and CDs are savings accounts that'll potentially help earn you more money over the course of a certain period of time. And remember, because a lot of people always wonder, these are advantageous to banks because they give banks access to deposits or cash. All right, let's do a high yield savings account first because the name just sounds like it's cooler. One of the biggest advantages, as you can probably tell from the name, is that you'll potentially earn more interest over time. That's because high yield savings accounts come with a higher APY or annual percentage yield. Potentially like, you know, let's say 4% instead of a more traditional savings account, which is like 0.4%. Plus, most high yield savings accounts compound interest daily versus most banks only deposit your interest maybe once a month. Over the long run, that practice means essentially more cash for you. Plus, high yield savings accounts tend to have lower fees. Seems odd, but it's primarily because high yield savings accounts come from online banks, which means they don't have as much overhead because they don't have the brick and mortar stores. It's also generally pretty easy to withdraw funds and the online account tools are pretty awesome. Since again, it's online banks primarily offering it. And yes, remember all the best high yield savings accounts are FDIC insured up to $250,000. Here's some cons. You potentially might face some sort of a fine or fee if you take out too many withdrawals. There used to be this federally cap limit that isn't really the case anymore since COVID because that was removed and even post then, and some institutions still don't apply it. Just make sure to check with the bank. It is sometimes a little bit tricky in terms of getting your money because there might be an extra step like having it transferred to a checking account first or something. You're probably gonna have to have a minimum balance in an account for high yield savings in order to get the best rate. And do remember that those rates fluctuate. The high yield savings account means there is no guaranteed interest rate that money is going to accrue. It's going to fluctuate with the market, which is sometimes really good and sometimes not so good. Most experts will say if you're looking for long-term savings, high yield savings account probably isn't your best bet, but it's very good for emergency instances or saving up for a specific purchase that you wanna make within the next, let's say three to five years.